today is Test It Tuesday. Test It Test It Tuesday. Test It Test It Tuesday. Test It Test It Tuesday. And we are testing. by detangling my hair or anything but usually with other shampoos it would ooh, it would feel so stripped that my hair would feel super matted this is not the case with this one so so far I would actually give this shampoo maybe I don't want to react so soon I'd have to use it several times before I can give a proper review but I think for right now this would probably probably be a solid four out of five for me. It's really not that bad. It's really good. The smell, I'm not that. I don't care either way for the smell. It doesn't smell bad. It doesn't smell super perfumey. Go ahead and use the conditioner now. Let's see if it has any sort of slip or anything like that. It's creamy. You my eyes. Comment down below. Let me know. What are you listening to? Are you listening to music, podcasts? What are you listening to? I like this. I just might have found a staple. Y'all, I don't want to overhype this up, but I really like this conditioner. The only problem is because it's in that little tube, and I'm pretty sure it's expensive. I told y'all I received this as a um, as a free product to review from Influencer, so I didn't have to pay for it. But when it comes down to paying for it, I need to double check the pricing. I like you. I like you. Stiff what? <laughs> I think my phone just died. Good. Now y'all can hear me clearly. Come look at this. Come look at this, y'all. <laughs> this is gliding. Like butter. Yo. I don't normally get this. If you can't tell, I'm impressed. But I don't want to be impressed. I don't want to be. Cause I feel like my hair be impressed. Press, press, press. Stop. I feel like my hair be impressed. It's probably why. Like I don't want to give this conditioner the credit, but I think I might have to. I will definitely be doing a follow up later on. Maybe in like two months or so, I would do an update on how I feel about this product still. But my first impression is that I like it. It's also not as tangled because I just got a trim when I got my hair pressed. So that all helps a lot. And I keep giving all these reasons why <laughs> besides just the conditioner. But I like it. I'ma just say that this is behaving so well because of my press and the cut. Cause this is not normal y'all, this is not. I am gliding this brush through, y'all. And the shed hair is not that much either. I'm gonna show y'all the final. I wish I had like another friend 
with a different hair texture here with me right now so we can do like a comparison i would love to do videos like that but i live too far away from my friends this is pretty much it for the shampoo and the conditioner so far i like it so far i would actually recommend it um i definitely need to look at the price but for receiving this for free and feeling how thick the shampoo my favorite part about this whole system is the shampoo because again I haven't had very good luck with shampoos so the simple fact that the shampoo feels moisturizing my hair didn't feel stripped and stringy that's what I get from a lot of shampoos like it feels a little too clean like my hair feels clean right now but with other shampoos it feels a little too clean to the point where my hair feels stringy I did not get that same reaction from this shampoo right now so I love the shampoo the conditioner I think it definitely has slipped for me I'm speaking for myself only <laughs> but for me personally I love the conditioner I do believe that I need to use it again because I have other factors going on with my hair right now I recently got it pressed I recently got a trim all both of those things I think makes it a little easier to maintain my hair and to manage my hair so this is not as kinky and as I don't even it's not as matted as it would usually be once it's in this wet stage so I think that helped a lot and that's also a factor in why I believe I should also do a follow-up video so far we like it we can get with this carol's daughter hey carol's daughter we can get with this we can get with this all right okay let's see how much hair i actually lost throughout this whole process i haven't taken it off this brush but let's see so to somebody to somebody else this might be a lot to me this ain't nothing let me make it into a little ball if you haven't seen my detangling video, that one was the size of a Barbie doll because I hadn't detangled my hair in so long. So to get this, it was like the size of an afro you can put on a Barbie doll. But this, I can deal with. This is how big it is in my hand. And that's how much shed hair came from this whole process. I think I would have lost way less if I kept my hair wet and drenched as I was detangling. So note to self for the next time again, I only didn't do that because I am recording and I was talking most of the time, but usually I keep my, my hair drenched as I'm combing through. enough it's actually not completely dry and I'm not trying to have it completely dry because again I just wanted it dry enough so that it doesn't take forever and it won't be super damp in the morning but the roots are mostly dry I will go ahead and bantu knot it using the leave-in cream and then the hair oil that they provided so I will be using these two items to bantu knot my hair. I will show y'all the final results tomorrow. And I'm just glad that you stuck around to go through this entire process with me. For the time being, I'm going to braid it down a little bit so it doesn't shrivel back up. So I will just loosely twist it and twist the ends just so it doesn't shrivel back up or get matted or anything like that I need to eat <laughs> I am super hungry but I will go ahead and twist up the ends and then when I'm ready I will bantu knot it so for the time being I just twist it around itself and then let me do the next side again I'm so glad you all have stuck around don't forget, if you haven't already, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. Join the family. It's not by force. I would just love it if you would subscribe and turn on the subscription bell so that you'll be notified whenever I have a new video that's posted. 
if you have any recommendations of products that you want me to test out or just things you would like to see more on my channel comment that down below and if you are a fellow youtuber and you would and if you would like to collaborate with me let me know you can reach me by my email address that's in my description or just comment down below and let me know it doesn't have to be that official through email and I am going to go ahead and eat and then I will twist out my hair and see how that turns out so I'll be back Share and subscribe. Let all of your friends know to come check out my videos. I have tons of videos on this channel, so please check it out. And thank you for watching. I usually post every Tuesday by 3 p.m. if life doesn't get in the way. If it does, then it's just going to be extended. But if not, I usually post on time every Tuesday. Rise and shine, gotta get the day started, sun beaming in my face as the blessings keep falling.